Before you decide to shoot me, I think you should know today is my birthday. It wasn't planned. It was a little planned. Okay, yeah, a little. I mean, you did apply. I did, but things like that don't happen to guys like me. Until they do. Until they do, and then I got injured, and I was like, no, this can't be. And then it happened. And then it happened. It did. I've got you covered. I got the dry goods covered. I got the chafing dishes. Great. You're all set, full. You are totally covered for the show. Hey, you need to follow your path. Things like this don't happen to guys like me. Until they do. Until they do. I'm going to host a reality TV show. Yes! Yes. <laughs> Seriously? This is your idea of On the Town? Well, we're not gonna break out into song and dance, but you are out of your apartment. And let's be honest, the bar scene and you? I'm not going online. No one meets in supermarkets. I was kidding about that. Were you? <sighs> Thanks. Thanks a lot. I'm not saying it does or it doesn't. It does. It doesn't. I'm saying maybe it does. It does. It doesn't. Now there's a difference between happening for and things happening. Semantics. No, happening for, that's like grand design. That's what I'm saying. No, that's what I'm saying and I can't accept that. Because you're stubborn. Thank you. I'm not. I'm happy. Two more, please. It's just... You're alone. I have you. And I would date you. Go on. If I were a man. Of course, you'd have to put out. That's my point. I don't need a man in my life. I put my glass down. Yeah. The bartender picks it up. No greater reason. That is free will. That is not a good example. Seriously, you two have been having this conversation since you were able to speak. Is it possible that maybe you're both right? No. no. Aha! Jinx, you both owe me a shot. <laughs> the job fell through? You're a good chef. One of the best. Something will come along. You should be in bed, resting. I need to check my blood sugar, and I need to eat something. Oh. Z? <gasps> so let's see, two Chicagos, a side of fries, and an uh, iced tea. Was there anything else? Every Thursday when I get off my shift, 
I come in here and I get two dogs, plate of fries, and iced tea. It's Friday. Yes. Yes, it is. Nicole's back. How are you feeling? I'm in love with a very special woman. Fifteen. I did not eat fifteen. Ten, maybe. Twelve. The one in your hand. Fifteen. So see? Not fifteen. Not fifteen. Hey, Luke! There you go, boy. <laughs> Did you just what? see that? Oh, the what? one that got away? <laughs> yes, for real. Oh. <laughs> Every time we go someplace, drink up. You might get lucky. And I should be drunk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> to you, the bringer of brisket. Uh, to you, the executor of egg cream. To your mom, the maker of matzo balls. What? Your mom made the best matzo balls. Luke, don't. What about mom? Oh, this never ends well. You ask like it was my fault. You were the one with the answers. I was trying to help. You were... I thought we were kids. You told me there was a reason. What possible reason could there have been, hmm? I don't know. Maybe whatever reason we're here for, maybe she was done. Maybe the lesson was for you. Maybe you needed to learn loss. Nice job. She's trying to make a point. <laughs> really? Why? I mean, you two have been having that debate since we were kids. And when your mom passed, it just turned into a war. And no one wins a war. You just have to get out, or you'll never move forward. You'll just stay stuck, hanging around like that painting. I've always believed there's a certain flow that you just have to let happen. Mm, not me. I move. You wake up tomorrow wondering what happened to yesterday. I try to live in the moment. Any moment, good or bad, I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be. You can either live the moment or live through it. Your choice. I'm getting life advice from a woman who can't get a date. I really hate you right now. <laughs> yeah, I don't get it. Of juice. I'm gonna go to the store and grab a small carton. Stay and rest. Only be gone a minute. Doctor's on speed dial. I love you. I love you too. Otherwise, it's just random chaos. That's my point. Random chaos. I step out of a subway station and turn left and buy a churro. Five years later, I'm having dinner with the love of my life. <laughs> I turn right, I buy a pretzel. Five years later, I'm in a ultra trendy, tragically hip, all too eclectic art gallery celebrating my birthday. Alone. Excuse me. 
Maybe there is a plan for you. Bigger than you know. A plan? Bigger than you know. Like maybe meeting a beautiful woman in an art gallery? <laughs> um, <laughs> maybe something as simple as getting a job. <laughs> you don't happen to cook, do you? I lost my chef today. Your chef? Oh. This is you? <laughs> Every ultra trendy, tragically hip, all too eclectic square itch. <laughs> Take the card. I appreciate it. Well, you never know. I believe there is a plan for me. But in that plan, I get to make choices about what takes me where I'm supposed to go. I mean, that's life's mystery. Do I stay in or go out? Do I take this job or that? It's choices. I think everything does happen for a reason. But I get to make choices about how that plan unfolds. Do I buy a pretzel or a churro? Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything else? How long have you been open? Be 15 years next March. 15 years, huh? I've been on this beat for the last year. Never once had to pull my gun. It's a good way to retire. Yes. Yes, it is. Would you like to have dinner with me? Before you decide to shoot me, I think you should know today is my birthday. Everything okay out here? Yeah. Yeah, everything's just fine, officer. Miss? Never even fired a gun before. Can I ask? My reason? That seems to be the big question. The big answer? I'm gonna be a mother. Yeah, I don't see the connection. I'm out of work. I'm a chef, and as of today, an unemployed chef. We're not even married yet. I wanted to be married before my baby girl was born. Baby girl, <laughs> congratulations. Not me. My girl, Sarah. She's not had an easy pregnancy. She's been really sick. Bills, half-assed insurance, and the place that I was working just went under today, and why the... Why the hell am I telling you all this? I have that face. Look, I gotta go, but, um... Thanks for, you know. Hey! You said chef? Yeah. Why? Today just might be your lucky day. I got an in with the owner. Tell her Luke sent you. Oh shit, really? This is for real? It's Sarah? She's always telling me everything happens for a reason. <laughs> yeah, well.
having me be back. Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> oh. Accident. That's the way I used to be. All these things were not so